Hi, we are live at QuickBooks Connect San Jose. My name is Rich Priest. I am the US country leader for Intuit and for QuickBooks. And with me, I have Cecilia. Hi, Rich. Hi Cecilia. Hi. And we <laughs> want to take a couple of minutes today to talk about a brand new feature at QuickBooks Connect called Hall of Heroes. Now, Hall of Heroes is all about celebrating the passion and the, the energy and the enthusiasm and the courage of our small businesses. And Cecilia has been the real brains behind bringing this to life this year. Cecilia, can you tell us a little bit more, what is Hall of Heroes? Yes, yeah, so as we just said, we're super excited to bring this all new activation to QuickBooks Connect for the first time. Um, so the idea behind this activation was to really put our customers, um, one from each of our customer segments, so an accountant, a small business owner, a self-employed, and a developer, um, really at the forefront at, um, of QuickBooks Connect and thinking about how we tell that story. So um, as I was thinking through this, um, one option was to potentially tell a lot of different stories in a very high level way. Um, but rather than doing that, we chose to go in the direction of telling four stories in a very in-depth, um, very personal and emotional way. Um, so attendees here have the opportunity to wander through um, these walls and they will uncover stories about um, adver um, people overcoming adversity, mm -hmm. um, people overcoming obstacles, um, and within those stories we've actually procure procured artifacts from their journeys. So um, just as an example, um, our self-employed photographer Elena Kulikova, um, we have her two first ever cameras that she was gifted when she was you know, just 16 years old um, actually on display. Um, we have our small business owner Easton, um, his um, he is a, uh, he creates prosthetic limbs um, for those who need them. And so we actually have one of his first ever models on display. Um, so it's really cool. It's a really amazing way to bring these people's stories to life. And um, we've really been enjoying telling the stories so far. And Celia, I, I know, I mean, I mentioned courage a moment ago. There's so much courage that, that bleeds through these four small businesses. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and I know there are many, many like them. Yeah. And so the passion that they show, what, what would you say is a lesson that other small businesses could take from these four? Yeah, no, absolutely. I think from these four in particular, I think um, just having the, the tenacity um, to persevere and overcome obstacles, um, each of these four has, you know, things have come up in their path where um, it would been it would have been easier for them to give up for them to go in a different direction um, maybe get a job somewhere but instead they chose to overcome that and keep going and um, trust themselves that they could get themselves through it um, and really have overcome some things that a lot of people would have given up um, but all of them have said that ability to persevere has gotten them to places that they never would have imagined possible. Yeah. So Yeah, no, um, it's, it's inspiring, I know, mm -hmm. for, for all of us, and certainly, again, the millions of small businesses. And then I know, you know, last but not least, mm -hmm. we have the activation wall behind us. Yes. And this is yes. where the 4,500 attendees yes. can actually tell their own story. So yes. can you just share a little bit more about the activation wall? Yes, absolutely. So um, rather than just having people kind of um, passively interact with the activation, we wanted a way for people to um, actually share their own stories. So um, you'll see on the wall behind us, we've actually asked attendees who are coming through to, um, as they're going through and reading the stories, think about how they relate to each of those stories and put themselves in one of these casts. So um, the casts we have are the problem solver, um, which comes from our accountant. Um, we have the creator, which is our self-employed photographer. Um, the innovator, which as I mentioned, Easton, um, who creates prosthetic limbs. And um, the advocate, which is um, Jeremy, our developer. Um, and so on the back wall, each attendee will think, who do I identify with and um, how can I participate in their story? And then you'll take down a pin um, and put the pin on your lanyard or your backpack. And then in the place of the pin, you'll actually leave an answer um, to a prompt, which includes you know, how, what innovators inspire your curiosity so that by the end of the conference, we're going to have this massive wall full of inspiration uh, with people leaving their stories behind. So it's really amazing. Yeah, no, I love it. I love it. You know, this is something we're doing for the first time, as we mentioned, this Hall of Heroes. Mm -hmm. And I think heroes is the magic word here. Yeah. They truly are heroes. And yeah. hopefully this is something we're going to do again in future years and yes, future completely. QuickBooks Connects. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we've only been open for a couple of hours and you'll see a lot of the pins are already gone. People are leaving and connecting over which pin they've taken, saying, you know, I'm the innovator, I'm the creator. So it's really, it's a really awesome way for people to connect yeah, with themselves that's very cool. as well. Yeah. Well, thank you for doing this. Thank yes. you for doing it on yeah, behalf of our customers me. as well. Yep. And uh, hopefully we've shared some insights today from QuickBooks Connect San Jose. Yeah, thanks for watching.